Hello guys, welcome back to Bedi News TV. Our name is Kofi Atinka. Atinka one. This Atinka here. Matia, my brother, then could be commenting say, "Master, your name." We do, we do hear that many times. Yeah, but hey, I need to tell you my name every day, every time, any time that I do videos. So that the new ones will know that this is your boy Kofi Atinka. Atinka one. Today we we'll be talking about a hey, Jonathan Mensa. Jonathan Mensa has a message for uh, the new boys. I'm talking of a uh, Nike Williams, Patrick Pfeiffer, and Brucio. Then also not forgetting the player called Salusu Muhammad. You know, all these guys uh, now have agreed that they will play for the Blasters of Ghana. You know, uh, in Zambia, uh, Jonathan Ward the moment. And then also Antoine Semenyon. You know, Antoine Semenyon played uh, his debut game for Ghana against Madagascar and he got injured. He couldn't go to the uh, Central African Republic game, but he has recovered. He's covered small, small, but hey, he's 90% uh, fit. Now, but we're talking about him, his transfer target for a big club in Europe. You know, Charlie Blaster, Renyabo Blaster, and Kwano. Yeah, the quality of a big team about so we'll be talking about these two guys very very soon right here but before that this is very news tv don't forget to subscribe to the channel you hit notification bell you select all then also you comment you like and you share this uh, very video now let's start which one should we talk about you talk about uh jonathan mensa or uh Antoine Semenyo. let's start with Antoine Semenyo before we come back to jonathan mensa's message that is having for this young talented player who wants to play for the blasters of ghana you know the scottish giant celtic have uh, I have not given up on a player called Antoine Samuel and are keeping eye on the Black Star striker according to multiple reports in uh, so, uh, Scotland. Yeah, Scotland. The Scottish champions champions have previously been linked with the forward and his agent claimed that they expressed interest in the potential deal earlier this very year. Year. And to a summer, you know, Celtic want to sign him and this year so they came around. You know, this is what the manager said. It's what the manager said, let, let, let me quote him, let me quote, let me quote the manager. Yeah, he said, if it does not happen during this summer transfer, we Yes, the manager said, uh, even this transfer uh, summer window, if it does not happen, he thinks that uh, the next one, that's the January transfer window, and to Semenyo will be in the scene again for Celtic. Though he told a uh, transfer expert, pet uh, record, pet record, this guy had me for anything, anything. So that's what uh, he said. You know, he controls that Celtic have been keeping eyes on him for a while now, and I believe they will continue to tally come around until this deal comes to pass. You know, Antoine Samuel made his uh, Brasta City debut on final day of 2017-2018 season, replacing uh, as a player called uh, Kelly as a second substitute in their last that's three to loss to uh, several United. The 22-year-old was born in England and is of a Ghanaian descent. On uh, 1st June 2020, he made his debut for the Blasters of Ghana in the 3-0 win over uh, that's, uh, Madagascar. And also, when they're going to Central African Republic, the guy couldn't go because of injury situation. So now let's talk about this player. Player called Jonathan Mensah. Jonathan Mensah is having some message for this guy. Jonathan Mensah, Jonathan Mensah. You know, Jonathan Mensah uh, has spoke about uh, this young guys, that's Antoine Semenyon, uh, Patrick Pfeiffer, and Nike Williams, and Brucio, Salus Muhammad joining the Black Stars for the World Cup, okay? And uh, Charlie, without wasting much, like, let me go in straight what he said. That is what uh, he told, uh, like he said, during the interview. He said, as a player, I have uh, just to focus on doing my best for my club and if I'm being called into the national team squad I will go and help the team and it is good that they are choosing to play for Ghana sometimes it happens that we some 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 come and play qualify qualifiers and do not play in the tournament proper for some reasons but uh, you know I'm not coach nor a management member so hey Charlie this guy is saying that you know so there are players who will come and play the qualifiers and there are players who also will come and play in their tournament proper because Charlie because of one or two reasons there is sure we know that you know players who have form doing the qualifiers but doing the proper 
tournament their form will go down and some form made the put in form so they'll have the opportunity to play for the national team that they play in the qualifiers and those who did not play the qualifiers will be on form then the coaches will be calling them so Jonathan Mensa is saying that hey he's not a coach nor a management member so he cannot decide that who plays for the in, in the tournament or who will not play in the tournament but for him there he will continue to do his best at his club level and if he is being called to play in the tournament sure he will come and help the blasters of Ghana so hey do you think that the guy is afraid because a defender and you have two tall and potential uh, center backs for the blaster uh, Ambrose is a very fantastic defender Patrick Pfeiffer is also a great uh, defender also so do you think that the guy is afraid that's why he's saying that or you think that it's a right call that that's why he's saying that hey he doesn't care he's playing football at the club level if the chance came for him to play for the blasters and they invite him he'll come and play let me know what you think about this uh, issue concerning these guys coming to play for the blast my name is Kofi Atin Kantin Kawan subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell select all then also comment like and share